In the last phase, you built a prototype of your idea. So you tried to come up with something that you can hand to another person and get them to interact with your design so that you can get feedback. You are hopefully a little curious to find out how the person you interviewed responds to your design. So that's the goal, to give your design to that person that you interviewed and see what they think. Just like before, try to have an 80% listening to 20% talking ratio. The other thing to realize is that when you are taking something you have designed and giving it to somebody else, it's very easy to get defensive and to explain why you did what you did. Remember though that the person you are speaking with is a great source of information about whether or not what you have created meets their needs. So listen to them, ask questions, and take a lot of notes on what they say because all of this is going to be really useful moving forward in making your next iteration of this design. It's very possible that your design will change as a result of what you hear. As you speak to your interviewee, use your prototype as a way to focus the conversation with your interviewee. It's also totally okay for the person you interviewed to disagree with how you went about solving this problem. Leave your ego at the door and listen as the person gives you feedback about what you've created. That person is the expert on how she or he feels about the situation that you designed for. So listen and use this as an opportunity to improve the way you have thought about the design now that you have something tangible in front of you. And as before, be sure to put all of your notes on the Jamboard so that all of you can see what you recorded and what you were thinking as you got your feedback. So you're gonna have seven minutes on the clock for this testing phase. Have fun.